Hello, my name is Zain Asad from Asad Z Man Films, and today I will be reviewing. So, this is the Pseudophoto TP25 RGB photography light. It has a display LCD that is 2.2 inches, it has an on off switch, a DC port, and a 1 4th inch screw hole. The build is pretty good, it's mostly plastic, but it doesn't feel cheap. Uh, don't drop the light though, it might actually damage it, but that goes with any other piece of gear you have. Anyways, its Kelvin range is from 2800 to 10,000 Kelvin. It's a rechargeable battery and has a CRI of 98 plus. Now I used this light for some client work and it came through. I used it mostly as a fill light. If you want, you could check out the video that I created for the client in the description below. Now there are a lot of light wands out there, but this light wand is perfect. It comes with a little traveling case also it came with a mini tripod and and the charger as well i was actually building a set for an artist and we decided to use a sterilite which is kind of a coincidence they actually rented out the sterilites for the day now this light compared to the sterilites is basically kind of the same thing the sterilites lasted about three to four hours on a full charge and this light lasted about the same time. But honestly, for the price of one Asterolite, you can get six of these bad boys. Like seriously, like one Asterolite is like a thousand dollars. It's basically the same thing. It's kind of like the same thing as an Asterolite. Maybe it doesn't come with a case. And maybe, it actually feels like the same quality build too though, honestly. Maybe without this blue little trim, but it's the same thing. You can create the same effect with this light as the Asterolites. I'm an independent filmmaker and I started out with like budget friendly, like super cheap gear, but now having experience with professional high-end, like professional high-end cameras and lights and stuff, I realized there really isn't that much of a difference, maybe the brand and maybe the build quality and maybe the lifespan, but eventually, like essentially, they're actually like the same. But I believe if you're creative enough, you can accomplish anything you put your mind to. It's about, I wanna say, it's about two inches wide and 24 inches long. I just wanna say thanks so much Pseudophoto for sending me this light. It was actually perfect timing because I was actually looking into getting some light wands, especially like this, so I could just have on hand. But I have been using this light and it's been coming in handy. I don't have to worry about a wall plug anymore because it's rechargeable. So, I mean, I just want to say thanks to photo and look, I don't know, I should turn this on, but see, it's like super, super dope actually. You can change a whole bunch of colors. You could change this to, it's technically a disco party. It's like a lightsaber. If you look at my Instagram, I actually did a video currently about it. It reminded me of a lightsaber when I first got it. Sorry if I'm not allowed to say lightsaber. Sorry, George Lucas. See, so it goes all the way from orange to white light, how bright the light is. Lower, dim that down. You could just add that. Or you could brighten it up. It's like super bright now, sorry. So this is the paparazzi. This is like a fire effect. So it does have 10 effects on it. So this is fireworks. This is a faulty bulb. This is an RGB circle, I guess. So it just goes around in different lighting. This is back to the paparazzi. Which is pretty cool. Ah. Ah! So you could change the frequency of like how crazy it is. Like this is the police, the popo. This is the police squad coming to your house. The, the two ends are made up of, I wanna say metal. Like it's metal around it, but it's plastic inside, it's weird. Fire truck, which is pretty cool actually, but you could change the frequency down to make it slower or really fast. This is the ambulance. This is a fire. It's 
see how this... Uh, I guess I could see this as a fire. This is at 4400 Kelvin. All the way to 2800 Kelvin. All the way to 10,000 Kelvin. Now that's a really cool, cool light actually, so... Yeah. But yeah, I just want to show you this cool little light. The link to purchase the TP25 RGB light is in the description below. Once again, thank you Suto Photo for sending me this light. I super appreciate it. I think it's actually really cool. And you know, it comes in handy. I got to say like it looks it looks small on screen, but it's actually like pretty it's 2 feet. So I mean, 2 feet of light, especially in slim and stuff, so you could just put these in the corners or on top of someone. Like that's a cool effect right there. Whoa. But um yeah. Just wanna say thank you guys.